Jason Sago, professional MMA fighter. I have uh, eight wins and one loss pro record, and I train out of uh, Bolton, Ontario in Canada. Um, I started uh, actually while I was in university. Uh, one of my friends just saw me messing around on the bag and then he invited me into a karate slash hybrid Muay Thai class. And then I started from there and from there I was introduced to another circle which is uh, Jiu Jitsu. There was a brown belt teaching at the university and I kind of just fell in love with Jiu Jitsu and I really kind of stuck towards more of a Jiu Jitsu path and also cross training between uh, the Muay Thai and also later on I added some wrestling. I think it's a good idea to train each dis discipline separately so you have a thorough understanding of that discipline so if you want to learn wrestling you go learn from a pure wrestler so you have a good knowledge base of just that individual sport and then when you want to learn the Muay Thai you can come to a place like Tiger Muay Thai in Thailand and learn that individual sport so I believe in focusing you know whether it's pure Jiu Jitsu you know learning the Gi it gives you great fundamentals and then have an MMA coach who has knowledge in each of those areas and is able to tie it all together I'm not, I'm not, you know, I'm not in the sport to, to hurt anybody at all, and I really hope that my opponent has a full recovery and that, you know, there's no serious long-term damage. I do this sport for a challenge to myself because I think doing this sport where it's just pure, I find it's such a, a raw sport where it's like you don't have any any tools to use. You're, the only tool you have is your own body, so you have to have a really thorough understanding of, of your own body, your own capabilities, and also your limitations. So MMA is like. A, it's a self-study, a you know, you have to know exactly who you are mentally, physically, so it's a, it's a huge challenge and, you know, you meet really high quality people through training in this sport. Some of my closest friends have come from, from training in this sport because it really forces you to take a deep look at yourself. I stay calm pretty much the whole time and, I, and it's a good thing to be a little bit nervous because I think that really primes your body for the upcoming fight, for the upcoming battle. So I always think it's a good thing to, you should be on edge. It's a good, it's a good sign if you are on edge. If you're completely calm, like you're just going to take your dog for a walk, it's probably not a good thing going into a fight. So I think you should be on edge. And on the other hand, you shouldn't be overly nervous. You shouldn't be, never be scared. You know, you should be well prepared. So if you go through a six week training camp and you train your ass off, then you should be well prepared. And I do yoga now pretty much every day on a daily basis. And I think it's awesome for strength, flexibility, uh, muscular endurance, and also peace of mind. And your breathing, when you're going into a fight, you really have to control your breathing because that can severely affect your cardio. So there's tons of elements that, that are in yoga that will help your, your MMA career. So that's why I've created a, a yoga program and it's going to be done by the end of this year. And you can check it out at yogamma.com. He's mean. He's mean. He's, mean. He's not a nice guy. <laughs> oh, beats me up every day. Uh, 
It's like beating me up more than normal today. <laughs> it's because the camera's there. I think we should turn it off. <laughs> Good man, I'm a little, a little tired today. Yeah. But yeah, I think throughout the week you just get stronger at Tiger Muay Thai. You know what? All aspects of my game have improved. Coming down to the Jiu Jitsu with Fernando, amazing instructor. Uh, wrestling, Roger and Brian, like world class wrestling, really good for MMA style. And then the Muay Thai trainers, I mean, Thailand's the land of Muay Thai, so you won't get better Muay Thai trainers than here. It's been amazing, you know? Best trainers in the world, amazing training partners, really organized camp, you know, you have the best of everything here, so I'd definitely recommend coming to Tiger Muay Thai. The final goal is to be in the UFC, to compete at the, the highest level. And uh, that's something I'm always working towards. I'm always working towards improving all of my skills to be a better fighter, to be a better person. And uh, I travel you know, to camps like Tiger Muay Thai to, to do that and travel around the world to, to meet people with different specialties. And I try to learn from them and study under them. What's next then? Uh, go home Wednesday. You know, I had a really solid two months here. Really appreciate uh, everyone at the camp helping me out. All the way from the trainers, the training partners, to the managers, all the staff. It's uh, been an awesome time here the last two months and really hope to come back again next year and sooner if I'm lucky.